this afternoon I'm just going to pop together a really quick lemon um, crunch recipe. Very, very simple. You just need some ginger nut biscuits, um, <clears throat> very inexpensive in the supermarket, a can of condensed milk, some double cream, two lemons. Um, and ideally a dish that has a sort of loose bottom on it that you can actually make into the, uh, the tart kind of lemon crunch into. So we get 200 grams of ginger nuts, which we've blended in our food processor. And then I've melted the butter. Okay, so these have been blitzed up. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna add all the butter like that and then blitz it together to really mix it into our crumb. Very similar to like a cheesecake base. So then, hopefully that should be all blended together nicely, the butter, melted butter. And then I'm going to tip that out, just add that little bit of extra butter there. There we go. And then we're going to tip this into our container, our, our dish. And you need to flatten it out so we have a base. And then <coughs> all the way around. And then also go around and so it comes up the side. So I normally kind of go around the side, do the side bit like this. So you've got, you need to pack it together so that when it sets, it'll actually hold. So do that bit all the way around and then do the base. Pack it in and then we're going to chill this and we'll come back and produce the filling to go in the middle. Okay, stage two with our lemon crunch. This has been in the fridge, it's chilled. Okay, as you can see, I've made two. Okay, so I've doubled my recipe. And in the bowl, I have, sorry, I'm sure I have a can of condensed milk, where I've got two cans, and I've got 125 mils of double cream. And then into that, I'm gonna add the juice and zest of two lemons. This is in fact, four lemons, but obviously two lemons, okay? Now, something magical will happen. When I whisk this, uh, the acid in the lemon will react with the protein in the cream and will automatically thicken it, a bit like magic, okay? Now, obviously, um, I had one uh, cameraman a moment ago. Now, I've got a guest camera person that's actually joined me. Um, oh, now, all you need to do, I'm gonna splatter it everywhere. Whisk it gently, or you can actually do this with a hand whisk. And you're just basically mixing it in, and uh, as you can see, instantly, look at that, it's gone thick, okay? So you, you can probably save the mess like I normally have, and I've got it here. You could just use an ordinary whisk to whisk it in, and now I'm just going to stir this last bit in, and you can feel how thick, so that's got the lemon zest, the lemon juice, the condensed milk, and the double cream. And then all we do, this is such an easy dessert, all we do now is place this... Now I've stirred that all in. See how thick it's become? Look at that, look. And then pour it into your lemon, your ginger biscuit crunch base. Fill it up and kind of smooth it out. And then that goes back in the fridge to chill. And then in a while, I'm just gonna decorate it with a few fresh raspberries. Okay, so that will basically go in there. So I've made one big one and one little one. Let's just hope that this mixture stretches enough to go over this big one. So I only had one little tin. Probably not. This is gonna be a slightly thinner version. Okay, and that's it. Okay, I'll come back to you in a second when this is set and we can decorate it. So after a couple of hours, it's been in the fridge, it's chilled nicely, and then we're gonna lift it, this out, okay, to serve it. So a little tip, get a glass or something, place the glass, there we go. And you can lift it up, place it onto your serving platter, like so, quite crumbly, and then, I'm just going to use some fresh raspberries to decorate it with, just in the centre. And <clears throat> oh, tickly, cough. just put a few raspberries in the centre, sort of a nice contrast between raspberries and the lemon. Move this range around. And then maybe place a couple of little sprigs of fresh mint in there just to make it look quite attractive. There we go. So there's our lemon crunch dessert, very, very easy to make, and only needs a few ingredients. 
hope you enjoy over the weekend.